all right guys this is zinc and i uh, gonna use here weekly chart here and let me show you why i use weekly chart here so in the weekly chart we have seen double bottom pattern right exactly uh they're following moving average exponential 200 if you want to see previous market behavior and right now they are following same uh, method and they are forming a double bottom pattern here right most of the people are telling here this is a w pattern whatever name is doesn't matter have you seen we have seen like a double bottom and after that we have seen here a neckline just they broke this neckline here and creating a new high from this area right so that means they are trying to run from this area right toward upside and we have seen this is called trend reversal pattern in a large time frame we have seen price was running in a downtrend all right so after that we have seen a trend reversal pattern from this area and it is trying to continue toward upside all right so let me show you where is the resistance line by you uh, in a weekly chart so in that case i want to connect more process point like here first my resistance will be here uh, why because we have seen in this area we have seen multiple rejection from this area have you seen as a support support and the support and here price not able to close above this line and i'm not calculating this point right now and here you can see multiple rejection from this area and here we have so exactly we have seen around 198 is our uh, is our uh, resistance line right now now you can uh, let's jump to daily chart so in the daily chart uh, what we have seen when we drawn this uh, resistance line in a weekly basis we have seen just in there uh, 200 sma are there so that means this area is very strong all right so let me show you if you want to see uh, according to uh, trend channel so let me show you the trend channel in a daily basis i'm gonna connect most tasks lower point here and then let me most the recent process point we have seen most recent process point are there here resistance line support and resistance line so now we have seen prices running in this range right now here like that all right so exactly in this area uh, where a uh, transcendental uh, the lower band are uh, forming as a support and that similarly if you want to see here according to diagonal uh, sorry horizontal trend line we have seen there is exactly 200 exponential moving average are there that means this area are pretty strong support right they are forming like that and we are expecting uh, the price will continue toward like that right here so we have seen that that is our resistance line let me show you here uh, in a four hour chart how it should look like that if you want to see in a four hour chart we have seen prices running in an uptrend because all moving averages are arranging sequently have you seen all are arranging sequently and the 50 moving average still running above 150 moving average that means price is running in an uptrend and according to price action method we have seen prices creating higher high and higher low higher high and higher low higher high higher low right like that they are running so we are expecting price will reverse from this area we have seen a buy opportunity so but 
question is that most of the people are entering anywhere they knows the trend is up but sometime they are entering in an overbought zone and after that prices reverse back again and hit their sl all right so now i can see most of the people are start buying in this area and prices reverse back again so that is why we must wait to retrace the price toward this supporting line right exactly we are looking for a buy when they are confirming any candlestick pattern or other indicator above that supporting line that is our entry point don't do that other mistake right so now let me show you now question is that how can i confirm the, mar the uh, that market will reverse from this area or it will retrace toward this area right most of the people are entering here exactly by and placing somewhere sl here and after that price just retrace and hit and start pushing up price toward upside that is the big mistake so always i uh, in my video i always explain when you are going to enter in this market always find out the cause of your entry that means in that case we are using some cause like bounce back some cause breakout some cause candlestick pattern like that all right so let me show you here so now you can see we never seen any bullish candlestick pattern or bullish signal in this area so that means we never gonna enter buy here we are looking for here buy opportunity that means any candlestick pattern crossover breakout whatever according to you all right so now we confirm that price will go up from this area we are expecting but there is no hundred percent accuracy in this market remember all up probability all right so if any candlestick bullish candlestick pattern form here so that means it is a probability to reverse from this area not hundred percent sure nobody a hundred percent accurate remember so in that case we're gonna place buy order so let me jump to 15 minute chart now you can see let me do a little more uh okay now we have seen in a 15 minute chart price is running in a downtrend right have you seen price is running in a downtrend let me zoom a little more have you seen price is running in a downtrend they are giving some correction all right after running this long wave from this area we have seen here retrace run retrace run now retracing so in that case uh, when we place buy order let me show you here clearly we was looking for a breakout here they broke this area and that was our buy entry have you seen this one so similarly after running long run price was running like that creating something higher lower higher lower and we have seen some resistance line for the short period after breaking this resistance line you can see so similarly same method we are going to use here we have seen multiple rejection price trying to break like that whatever so in that case we must draw some resistance line like that right once they break this resistance line that is that will be our buy opportunity right that is called high probability trade let me zoom a little more then it comes to no right now right now what moving average exactly they are following have you seen they are running below 200 moving average right so that means price are rejecting moving average 200 or you can say this is a uh, simple moving average 200 so if you want to end up with the buy we must wait to break this level all right so that means we are looking for a breakout uh, in 200 moving average uh, sma ema whatever once the break so we'll start buying that is our buy opportunity so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe thanks for watching